talk to a 14 year old girl with cystic fibrosis about the need for her first admission to hospital for iv antibiotic mm -hmm. girl name is uh, uh, alina alina okay okay uh, you make your keep on okay i will make the time okay When you are ready, you tell me. Okay, we can start. Okay. Start. Hello. Hello. Yes, you start. Yes. Carry on. Yes, start. Yeah. Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, I believe I'm talking to Elena. Yeah, I am. Yeah, hi Elena. I'm Dr. Heba, one of the doctors here in the hospital. Nice to meet you today. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Um, Elena, I'm here today to discuss with you your condition. And um, uh, is that okay with you? Yes, Doctor. You can discuss. Okay. Uh, please, can you tell me what is your update regarding your condition? Yes, I am uh, having uh, this condition, uh, inherited condition called this cystic fibrosis. Yeah. yeah. And uh, nowadays I am a bit having a fever and I am bit sick. So I am down nowadays. And no one has uh -huh. informed the further line of yeah. management. Yeah, I'm so sorry to hear that. And um, uh, I'm here with, to discuss with you your need for admission in the hospital. Um, you know that um, the uh, investigation done for you showed that you have uh, some bugs in, the, in your chest. Uh, did anyone tell you that? No, doctor. Why doctor uh, admission investigation is okay, but why there is need of this admission? Yeah, uh, at first I appreciate your voice, okay, but uh, uh, we, you need admission because you need to, 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 be, to receive some antibiotic to kill this bug. And um, the most important part of uh, your management to just give you a physiotherapy. This is will improve your uh, chest condition. Uh, doctor, you are uh, that, that I will manage uh, at my home. My one of my relative is uh, she is physiotherapist and also one nursing staff. So I will manage at home. So I don't like doctor hospital admission. I I really appreciate your desire. Okay, but uh, I'd like to do, it's not enough that uh, you just receive uh, the physiotherapy. And I know that you are following well with the physiotherapist, but uh, you need to take uh, um, uh, antibiotic through uh, uh, the blood to be effective to killing the bug. And uh, that's why we need to admit you to insert uh, uh, um, a line that you will take uh, the antibiotic through it. Oh, doctor, I really am really scared. It is really frightening for me to answer what you are speaking of these uh, lines and all that. I'm really afraid. I'm so sorry to tell you that I know it's a difficult situation, but uh, I want to tell you that we are doing the best for your, uh, for your health and your condition. Um, I know that some um, hospital admission isn't an easy issue for you, but um, as I mentioned, that um, the bugs that you have may affect your uh, life, may affect your uh, your health. That's why 
we need to give an effective uh, antibiotic to kill this bug. Okay, doctor. So now, what is your this further line of management once you will admit? Yeah, we just need to just uh, for you taking uh, uh, some cultures like uh, uh, we need to take uh, uh, sputum culture after we start the uh, the antibiotic. We need to so to see if it's this antibiotic is going well with you and it's effective to killing this bug. So we will follow you up with some investigations. True, doctor. But how long you will stay? Uh, how uh, need to stay there in hospital? Um, anyway, we will give you the antibiotic. We will start the antibiotic. If you going, if your condition going well with the antibiotic, okay, we will consult the uh, cystic fibrosis team to discharge you and to continue your antibiotic uh, at home. But before we discharge you from the hospital, we have to be sure that you are okay and uh, your body responding well to this antibiotic. Mm. Once you are you are okay, we'll discharge you home. Once you also you are prepared well to give you yourself the antibiotic at home, it's okay. You will go home and continue the antibiotic. Is that okay with you? Oh, doctor, but also I have other plan and with my, then once you will get admitted, then it will be difficult for me to attend the birthday party of my friend and I will be socially cut off. I would not be able to interact. So would you allow them? I really, I really appreciate your feeling. I really, I really know that you, you, you want to enjoy your life. Okay, and we too, me, uh, we, uh, we too need for you is a good life, and uh, we need to enjoy your life too. But uh, just think, if you didn't get the proper uh, treatment for your condition, you won't, be, you won't be able to attend this party. You won't have the power to go and enjoy your life, isn't it? Okay. Apart from this IV antibiotic and physiotherapy, and what other treatment you would start? Yeah, we will give you also uh, some uh, nebulizations, like a treatment given by nebulization that will help you and will help the physiotherapist to do uh, to just clear your lungs from this bug. Also, we need to admit you in. Um, as, um, isolated cubicle because uh, this bug may be infectious to the others. That's why we need to get rid of this bug with a proper antibiotic and uh, prevent the spread of this uh, this bug to the others. Okay, but doctor, is it clear right? yes, but isolated. How long, doctor? Again, it would be it is an. It's scary for me. I will be again be feel isolated myself. How long you will keep in isolation if you become? Yeah, uh, once we give the antibiotic, uh, as I mentioned earlier, we will just follow you up how can how your body responds to antibiotic and how you get rid of, get rid of this bug. If this if we cannot if we can just. Uh, uh, suppress the activity of this bug from going active, it's okay to go home and you enjoy your life and to continue your course of antibiotic at home. Okay, doctor, I have another one concern. Uh, yeah. And you told me these are this line of management. In addition, I have Googled one, this gene therapy or stem therapy I have read. On the website, is there any role? Can you tell me? Would it help me in my condition? Yeah, yeah. I, I really uh, appreciate your knowledge. Okay, and uh, there is okay. But uh, if you want to discuss this issue, we will just refer you to the cystic fibrosis team, who will give you the proper advice regarding that, if it's okay for your condition or not and how you can start the, the gene therapy like that. 
Is that okay with you? Okay, thank you, doctor. Bye. Okay. And I know I, I, I'm just giving you a really choking uh, information, but um, uh, if you don't mind, can, can I go through what we've discussed today? Yes, doctor, you can proceed. Yes. Yeah. Um, we discussed uh, your uh, your need for hospital admission and why you need it for antibiotic given through the blood to killing the bug that uh, make your condition deteriorating and uh, giving physiotherapy, intensive physiotherapy and sanitation. Okay. Okay. I will give you uh, some leaflets regarding your condition to read more about uh, why you need admission and how what will happen when you be admitted is it okay okay thank you doctor okay thank you for your time oh, thank you yes dr devrakash yes. your repo in this uh, information background knowledge and uh, also this line of management and in addition uh, only thing you missed i think also i don't uh, remember you told for this uh, the diet doctor dietitian yes diet doctor yes physiotherapy no, no. i didn't i didn't mention dietitian but mm. um, i'm just um, because mm -hmm. you told me that she will be admitted uh, with fever and deteriorating chest condition. That's mm -hmm. why I'm just mention I'm just focus on the management of uh, exacerbation, you know, uh, mm. just for antibiotic and uh, physio intensive physiotherapy. And um, she needs to, to be a pick line to be inserted or long line to be inserted. That's why I'm focusing on that. No, I didn't mention the dietitian. <laughs> okay, that. okay. Otherwise, you did well, very well. Any other? No. Dr. Heron, Dr. Sandeep, yeah. you have any comments? Yeah, I think uh, you did very good. Very nicely. You covered up the points. Uh, only frequently you used antibiotics. Some people, they say it is a jargon and some people, they say if you can say yeah. therapy. Uh, therapy. Yeah, that point, that point uh, a lot of people in who's UK training say that antibiotic, it's really, it's a, it isn't a jargon. All hmm. people in the UK know what is antibiotic. I don't okay. know. <laughs> That's why. Yeah, but it is. I mean, okay. I think. And uh, yeah, other things uh, you nicely explained. Uh, like one point, he was telling his uh, he has a physiotherapist relative and uh, also nurse also. So both of them they can both both the objectives can be achieved at home <laughs> physiotherapy as well as IV antibody. Yeah. Uh, I don't remember what did you say. For the antibiotic? Yeah. No. He mentioned like the need in the hospital is to, uh, let's say, IV antibiotic as well as physiotherapy. Both these objective is achieved at home because he has a, you know, she has somebody in uh, relatives or in a circle who can come to the home and give physiotherapy as well as mm. yeah. give antibiotic. antibiotic. Yeah, uh, I mentioned that uh, uh, the bugs that you have will affect your life. That's why you need to take antibiotics through uh, uh, the blood, okay? And um, intensive physiotherapy. And also we want to follow you up. How is your body response to the antibiotic? And um, how is the bug going on? How is the activity of the bug going on? Once you be sure that your condition is stable and you don't need to be in the hospital anymore, you have to, be, to go home and continue your course of antibiotic. But before you go home, you have to prepare well how to inject or give yourself the antibiotics through the, this uh, line. 
That's yeah. right, because, yeah, the big client, she should be trained first, and we want to be sure that uh, the bug and the activity of the bug just suppressed and the right. condition is stable. Right, and the other point also you can mention, like at home uh, with sometimes this bug, it may, uh, you know, affect the other uh, persons in the uh, staying at home or... Yeah in the home sick, they can affect you also. So in both the way, it is ideal to get this medicine in a hospital setup rather than at home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Very... But yeah, uh, and I did one mistake. I did one mistake that I'm just mentioned that should be, uh, she should need, um, she should be admitted in uh, a separate cubicle at the end, uh, after um, six minutes left. Yeah, I mentioned it at the end. On, yes. Yeah, yeah. I have to mention it earlier, because, uh, yeah, this is the first first part of the management to be uh, managed in a, in a separate cubicle, because right. the bug right. may, be, yeah, may be infectious to the others. That's why. Correct, yes. Yeah. Anybody else, Dr. Pankaj? Dr. That was also my point that when the uh, doctor the role player said, like I have physiotherapist and uh, nurse to take care of me, there and there only that we should mention that you need to be taken care in a separate cubicle. We cannot uh, allow treatment at home, or it is not advisable to allow treatment at home because this bug may affect the other family members. Also, this bug is not something like a, a routine bug. We need to treat in a proper way. If we don't treat in proper way, the, we may need to, uh, uh, that this bug may not respond properly to antibiotic, it may become chronic. Or uh, we may, may okay. have to take further, uh, higher antibiotic further, or we may have to accelerate, escalate the treatment. Something like that, which will scare her in a decent way. Yes. So, you, you mean that uh, I scared her with my talk? No, 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 no. Or... We, should, we, we should give like some something which will convince in a medical way. Like if she does not take proper treatment, this bug may affect her life that you said rightly. Uh, yeah. We can also say like this bug may not be get cleared properly and this may bug remain for a longer period in your body if we don't give proper treatment and we may have to take further higher antibiotics if the bug does not respond to the antibiotic and treatment yeah. is not given pro in a proper way. That was my point. Okay. The same the way you said, like a little bit different way. But cubicle should have been mentioned earlier. That was the you know, rightly pointed. Shalom, then uh, let's um, wind up now hmm? or anything. Yeah.